it started out um, it's, it's just my mom and dad working out of a little apartment and uh, they called it Berkman and Associates which was dad and his one associate my mom I am Sharon Berkman and for the last 10 years I've been the president and CEO of Berkman International the Berkman method is has been called a motivational assessment more people understand it as a personality instrument a personality tool it really helps individuals and teams identify their strengths, their interests, their personality style and how they interact with others, how they can see themselves in a whole new light and relate to not only their getting their own needs met, but the needs of the people that they're close to and that they work with. I think the seeds for the brilliance of the Berkman were planted in his experiences as a B-17 bomber pilot during the Second World War. What he realized is that when pilots would come back from a dangerous mission, he would hear two of the flyers describe the same event but see it in very different terms. And he realized both were being honest and both were accurate, but they were seeing different aspects of it and they saw it in a different way. At the end of the day, we are social pack animals. So naturally, we want to fit into the culture and we want to thrive in, in the country, the culture in which we're raised. And so for the most part, people will pick up these traits and we tend to think that is, we identify that as personality. What the Berkman is actually measuring is much deeper than that. We believe that Berkman is, is able to dig into a, much of our core interest and personality styles that are also very much born into us and those remain constant and, and very similar across all cultures. We call it miracles that we've seen happen. We've seen it happen in corporate settings. We've seen it happen with students that are looking to better understand uh, what kind of college they should choose, what kind of major. We've seen it between husbands and wives, between managers and supervisors. And uh, uh, very often, I think in most cases, people are really trying their best to, to do things right and to get it right. You know, no one sets out to be anything but successful. But often it's, it's not having that ability to kind of have x-ray vision of what the other person is seeing through their own eyes, as well as what we are, are feeling in terms of our, our filters and our, our own style. I think for me, the most rewarding part of my job is when people turn and say, knowing that transformed my life. I had no idea that that person never planned to irritate me. They just are different from me. It's like an eye-opening, aha, uh, transformative experience. So when they see that, they drop the defensiveness, they drop the judgment, and they feel accepted and they feel that they can be accepting of others. Now we, we are in 20 languages and we have an international presence that is just beyond the scope of anything they could have imagined.